Hello there, folks. I'm here in Allenhurst, New Jersey. Beautiful, beautiful area. Lots of beautiful old homes right by the beach. Beautiful beach day today. It was just in the water and uh, it was awesome. But uh, I came here to share with you this house I just found on the way. This is now the third location just in this area of the North Jersey shore that I know of with a uh, hardy palm planting. Um, it's funny because you see lots of like, you got these Chinese fan palms planted out here. You've got more uh, planted, I think, across the way. Uh, somewhere yeah actually those are also Chinese fan palms up there tons of majesties tons of um uh yeah, majesty palms down there in pots um tons of uh, Christmas palms and other species so there's like palms and pots out everywhere that people put out for the summer so you see those all over the place but every once in a while it's funny you'll see these yards and what first caught my eye was this beautiful big yucca from the road but every once in a while then I look back and sure enough beautiful beautiful I'm not gonna I'm gonna try to be careful what I'm doing here but Look at this, they got it planted in here. It looks like several gorgeous dwarf palmetto. Um, really nice, I'm gonna get a shot there with the cacti, cause that is really cool. Um, they got these nice hardy cacti. I don't know what species this is. It does not look like uh, punchy humifus. It looks like actually, uh, oh, I don't know if it's a punch, punchy macroriza or, no, 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 it's, I, I saw the species when I was in Ohio growing. Um, I have a video of it. I forget what the species is, but it does not look like Eastern prickly pear, but a very nice species here. Um, looks like maybe it's getting a little too much water or something in that pot. They should really put it in the ground, but uh, either way, really cool to see um, this yucca here. This looks like yucca gloriosa. Absolutely beautiful with the flower stock there. Um, old, beautiful old Victorian house. Like I said, there's tons of gorgeous houses here. And then this dwarf palmetto, um, absolutely gorgeous. And in the ground here, looks like it's been in here for quite a while and just with the stock coming out. So I just wanted to share that with you folks. This is here in Allenhurst, New Jersey, zone 7A, really probably more like 7A, 7B, pretty similar to the DC area. Um, but it's really nice because in summer when DC area is baking and humid, much cooler by the coast. Even you just drive 15 minutes towards the coast, much cooler um, as opposed to away from it. And then in winter, it's also nice and mild. So it's a, it's a pretty cool location. And also just awesome because hardy palms are not common here, but you see them. Like I see a needle palm driving around, see this apartment building with all the window palms and you see these dwarf palmettos. Uh, needle palm, dwarf palmetto need no protection here. Window palms, so-so sort of depends if it's a bad winter maybe they will um and they do protect the ones up at those apartment buildings but it's just awesome to see you know because you drive around and see all these tropical palms plant out in pots in summer to see a, a nice hardy palm established here in the ground uh, it's just awesome like i said they're not common here um less so in the dc area but you still see them around which is just awesome and just a sign that they do grow here so yes palm trees do grow in new jersey here on the north jersey shore about an hour from new york city uh, really awesome to see have a good one folks try a sable minor dwarf palmetto in your own yard hardy to at least own six really great species. Take care.